what's, what's going on guys um not gonna skip the formalities for today because i really did want to have this conversation with you guys but you know make sure you like and do the good stuff okay um i was just laying down in the bed chilling and i came across this video right um it's a tiktok video posted on youtube right apparently this young lady is a popular youtuber i saw the name I'll leave the, um, the video in the description area below. It's like 11 seconds, so it's not a long video, so it's a TikTok version of a video. Um, but basically in the video, the girl was like, I may not look like much from the front, I may not look like much from the back, but from the side, I don't look like much, but we're working on it. And it really did spark the conversation that we kind of need to have today. Now, this is one of those interesting ones where I think that we might be having differing, differing opinions in the comment section. So I'm ready for it. I'm excited for it. So y'all make sure y'all get ready with your, with your Twitter fingers, your keyboard warriors. Go ahead and get ready with your answers. But today I wanted to talk to you why some foreigners may prefer smaller, bayat, thin types of Filipinas and women as opposed to thicker full-figured types of women now oh shit that's blasphemy doc you don't lost your mind you already know what it is they're thinking of better they're thinking of better we like them thinking of peanut butter we like them thinking of the snicker yes i know but there's one thing that i've noticed about girls who are thick they're just one or two steps away from fat gentlemen <laughs> and i say that with all due respect there are one or two steps away from fat thick girls Thick, T-H-I-C-K, apostrophe, apostrophe, exclamation point, exclamation point. Thick women in general are two steps or one step away from fat, bruh. And that's just being real. What I've noticed with smaller women is you can build that, right? They can, they can thicken up, right? They can get thicker. It's kind of like when a girl is thick, the only step she has from thick, the transition is to fat. You feel me? And I'm not saying that to be disrespectful. I'm saying that to be real. I'm saying that to focus on the realities of. And the reason I say this is because there's one thing that can happen to a female. Sometimes it's planned. Sometimes it's not planned. But there's one thing that can happen to a female that can make this transition something else. And that's if she gets pregnant. If you get a thick girl pregnant, she gonna get fat. That's just it. There, there, it's it's going to happen, and now we got to go through the process of her trying to get the baby weight off and all of that stuff, and, you know, it, it becomes a process. But I kind of feel like when you're dealing with somebody who is a small frame, they kind of thicken up, right? You know how when you, you know how when you make a roux, right? Some of y'all don't know what roux are, but you use cornstarch and water or some shit to thicken it up. I kind of feel like that's what happens when females have babies, because... You know, maybe they're not top heavy at the moment, but their breast develops milk and all that shit. And they go from negative A cups to positive C cups and shit. It goes crazy, man. It goes parabolic. It's bugging. I know. Doctor lost his mind. But I, I've seen it happen. But at least with smaller girls, they kind of grow into thickness, right? The thighs might get a little bit more full figure and stuff like that. So it's not so much a problem when they're smaller and they transition into thick i just feel that when you're thicker you kind of got two like i said you're only one or two steps away from being fat truth and we hear this sometimes but sometimes it's a, it's a reality we don't want to face right because gentlemen i get it we like them thick me too i do i do i'm not gonna sit there and lie to you but i am not adverse to a smaller framed filipina or woman in general either because i know the present the potential into them transitioning into a potential figure or grow into their body is also there as well so i know gentlemen it's up to you how you choose to deal with the types of women you like do you like them more thinner bayat which is thin and filipina small framed or do you like them a little bit on a thicker side i mean now a lot of people have asked me doc yo is there a such thing as thick filipinas dude i've made three videos on that so the answer is already yes that is true um and they do exist but likely you will find more Filipinas to be on the smaller end than the thicker end. If you had to do a quick ratio of the percentage of, you know, the availability in the country, you would probably find more small frames than you'll find thicker frames. But this is not to say that thicker frames do not exist. Because I'm already proven to y'all that it does exist. But I asked these questions to you guys in reference to body types that you like because I think that this is noteworthy. 
you know, again, I'm not telling you to focus purely on the aesthetics and the and the body types of Filipinas to determine whether you date them or not, or women in general to determine whether you date them or not. But we do have to sit there and accept the realities of what could potentially be. I'll say it one more time for everybody in the nosebleeds. Again, when you think you're about one or two steps away from fat, trust me when I tell you. But when you're thin and you're small framed, you can kind of grow into it. Now, that doesn't mean now. Don't get it twisted now. A girl who was a small frame can get pregnant and then blow up after that. I mean, there's a cycle, man. It can happen. It just depends on, you know, how your girl takes care of herself or how the young lady chooses to take care of herself and, you know, how y'all transition accordingly in reference to, you know, how she develops into her body type. Some girls can hold that thick frame forever, you know, keep the small waist and just, you know, ass fat for days. I mean, it's beautiful. I get it. I know. But just remember, you know, a couple chicken meals later, you know, a couple bowls of rice later, go to Monginnesau, let her eat all she can. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> things could things could go parabolic real quick. They could they could thicken up real quick. Um, and that's either way, man. Like thin frame going to thick, thick frame going into chubby chubby to fat <laughs> something to that effect all right but let me know in the comment section below man your body type choice man do you like them a little bit on the thinner side do you like them a little bit on the thick side let me know what it is baby but also make sure that you take what we've said into consideration when making your choices all right ladies and gentlemen like i said formalities aside love you guys y'all take care y'all stay blessed man back is out peace